Hi there, my name's Jolene. I'm one of the subject librarians at AIU. This is a quick video on how to access and use Box of Broadcasts, our TV and radio database. So there's a couple of ways you can access it. So you can go to the search just here and then click on Box of Broadcasts, or you can simply just Google Box of Broadcasts and click on the link here. First time you get to Box of Broadcasts, you'll be asked to sign in and you need to tell the system where you're from. So I'm gonna put in Anglia Ruskin University. First time you log in, it's gonna ask you to set up an account and to verify that account via email. Next time you log in and all the times after that, it's just gonna ask for your normal username and password. So I'm on the Bob platform. At the moment, it's defaulted to my Bob area. So this is the personalized area. I'll come back to this a little bit later. But the main features are the guide and the search. So if I go to the guide, you can see the content on Bob. So you can see from the guide, the content on Bob. So it's all the free view channels, plus a few international channels. And also if we keep scrolling down here, we'll also get to Sky Arts and Sky News. And if I keep going, we'll see that there's also radio channels as well. Now, what you can do from the guide, you can request that programs are recorded. And once they've been on TV, they'll be ready for you to watch. So if I scroll down, and I want to watch Judge Judy later on today, I can request that program, click on I'd like to watch this, and then once it's recorded, it'll be ready for me to watch. So if a program already says available to watch, you can click on that and watch the program straight away. You can see from the guide, you can go to times earlier on in that day, or you can go back in time to dates in the past. Or you can go to dates in the future. So everything that you record on Bob or Box of Broadcasts is available to everyone else and vice versa. So if you go to the search, you can look for already recorded programs. So there's a lot of content on Bob. There's a lot of programs that will support your studies. And there's also Film4 and other film channels. So I'm gonna look for John Wick. And the double quotation marks means it will search for John Wick as a phrase. Now, Bob Search is a transcript of all the programs. So if you go to search options, you normally get a better result if you restrict this to title only. If you were looking for a particular person or a particular theme, you could keep it as all fields and then it will search the transcript and you might find an interview with that person, for example. So here we can see we've got four results and three of them are from the John Wick trilogy. If I wanted to look at John Wick chapter two, I can just click and I can watch that. And there's some other features as well. So you can create your own playlists and these will be saved in the My Bob area. You can make clips of the program and also you can search through the transcript. So if I go to show transcript and then I wanna find out times where the word dog was mentioned, I can just search for dog and that will take me through the places in the, the film where the word dog was mentioned. So all your clips and playlists, they'll be saved in the My Bob area. So the My Bob area is where any of your requested programs are saved. It also gives you the playlists that you've created. And if you make your playlist public, other people can search for it and vice versa. So using the search, you might find that somebody has already curated some useful playlists for your topic area. Also from the My Bob area, you can go to any clips that you've created. And that's it for using Box of Broadcast. It's really simple and easy to use. Also, you don't need a TV license to use this service, but you must be in the UK.